Hey, it's Alex from Engage. Today, I'd like to give you a quick overview of Engage. After I launch the app and log in, I'm taken to the presentation library. In the left-hand column is a list of companies and teams that I have access to. There's also a space called My Presentations, which is personal just to me. To view a presentation, start by downloading it. Once it's local to your device, you'll be able to present it even without an internet connection. Let's edit a presentation. Click the pencil button in the top right corner of the thumbnail. Now I'm taken to the storyboard. This is a bird's eye view of my presentation that shows me all the pages and sections. I can drag to rearrange pages and add new pages and sections. To edit a page, just double click it. This is a freestyle page, which means I have total control over the layout. Simply select an object you want to edit, and all of your options will appear on the right-hand side. I can add new objects to my page by clicking the plus button at the top right of the screen. Make sure to check out our design tips video series for an in-depth look at what you can make using the freestyle page. Let's go back to the storyboard and I'll show you how to add a page to your presentation. Press the add page button in the section you'd like to add the page to. Now you'll see a list of thumbnails for all the different built-in page templates. Choose one that fits your needs. Let's add a deck page. You'll see that it already has fonts and colors that match the rest of your presentation. It's super easy to drop in images and video. Just click the placeholder of the mountain, choose your file. And that's it. Now let's add some buttons. Press the plus button in the top right of the screen. Choose the button you want, then drag it onto the page and set it up. To present your presentation, just click the play button in the top right of the screen. To share a presentation on the web, just click Allow Web Sharing on the right-hand side of the storyboard. Then click the Share button in the top right of the screen to view the link. When you're done making changes, just back out to the library and everything will be automatically uploaded to the cloud and distributed to everyone else on your team. That way, they'll always have the most up-to-date version of your presentation.